Back in April of this year, Google announced a new feature for Android that would automatically archive rarely used applications or games for those people who are running out of storage. When this was initially implemented, the feature was automatically triggered when you tried to install something from the Google Play Store but didn't actually have the space for it. Users would see a prompt like this, so the device could ask them if they wanted to enable the feature or not. Until now, we didn't have a toggle to enable or disable this new feature, and we were only able to enable it or ignore it when the prompt appeared. But Google has now begun rolling out a toggle for this new feature that can be found within the settings of the Play Store application. So we can find this by first opening up the Google Play Store, tapping on the profile image in the top right so that we can select settings and then tapping on the general category from here. Now we're gonna scroll down a little bit and you should see a new toggle labeled automatically archive apps. This should be disabled by default, but we can easily enable it with a simple tap. I assume the prompt will continue to appear for those who have run out of storage but are trying to install something when this has been disabled. So there should still be two ways to enable this archive feature. If you're curious about how this works, we can tap on the learn more link next to this toggle to be taken to a Google support page that talks about the new archived feature. It's important to know that when it kicks in and apps or games are archived, only the app data itself is removed from your smartphone or tablet. Your personal data that is attached to the app will remain in place. So if, for example, you have passwords saved in an app that gets archived, or if you have entered or synced some other type of data to that application, then that personal data will stay on your device just in case you decide to reinstall that application at a later date. If you see something that has been archived and you have no need to ever use it again, then it is best to fully uninstall that application or game so that you can recover all of the data that it was using. If you don't fully remove it, then you will be keeping bits of unneeded data on your smartphone or tablet. To check and see if your Android device has archived an application or game in the past, we will need to open up the Google Play Store application again, tap on your profile picture in the top right corner so that you can select the Manage Apps and Device option. From here, we're going to tap on the Manage tab at the top and then we're going to scroll through these chip filters up here at the top until you see the archive label. Tapping on this label will show you all of the applications or games that have been archived for you so that you can then choose to either reinstall those apps or remove them entirely and their personal app data from your device. As with all new features for Android, I appreciate it when Google or whatever OEM has added a way for the user to enable or disable it. 
I know this will be useful for a large number of people, but it's not something that I see myself personally using. And Android is at its best when they give the user the choice to use a new feature or to simply ignore it.